Hey guys, Professor Prime here with MyGenPlanet.com and today we are taking a look at not one, not two, but three. Godzilla, X-Kong, The New Empire. That's right guys, we are taking a look at the Godzilla, X-Kong, The New Empire metal figures. These figures are amazing. These are three of the four that you can get as of right now. I only was able to get three of them, so let's take a look at each individual one. So here we have Kong and the it's a it's die cast of course so we go ahead and just look at the packaging here these are the figures you can get right here uh this guy right here uh shimo i don't know who that is i, I didn't see him in the trailer that's a possible spoiler right there so hopefully not a spoiler maybe you guys might know who it is but i i don't so here's kong and then here's godzilla so let's take a look at godzilla here he's got the uh pink you know energy on his spikes same packaging nothing really different other than it says godzilla you know stuff like that and then here is the Scar King, which is, you know, he's the new, he's the big bad of this one. And I just realized that these have keychains on them. So that is actually pretty cool. So you can attach them to your key ring and stuff like that. So let's get these guys out of their packet. Taking a look at each figure, they are made out of die cast. So they have some heft to them, which is good because you do have the keychain. So let's go ahead and take a look at the new villain of the movie, King Scar King. So let's uh, see if I can get him to focus here. All right, so let's take a look at the detail here. Look, the, the face sculpt is amazing. And, you know, the detail of the figure, it's it's... I would be kind of careful though if you do use this as a keychain as these arms are very flimsy although the legs are very stiff but the arms are there these are more rubber so these could have a potential of snapping off over time there is no articulation it looks like it has arm articulation actually but it's just the it's just the ceiling on the figure so there is our villain uh scar king he's a pretty cool figure i actually well it's not really a figure it's a keychain but you can you know have display these you know if you want you can unchain right here can't unchain that and then you could then use it you can even display it really without move the keychain it looks it looks just fine like that so and next up we have godzilla which godzilla is looking pretty pretty intense now with this new i don't know super saiyan Ro rosette transformation power up he's got going on here he's got the he's got the pink energy to a scale the detail on the fins are amazing the head sculpt could, it, it looks kind of weird, but I think it's because the version of the movie, he has a longer neck and he's more like defined, where this one is a little chubby. It's a little on the chubby side. So as I said, you can unhook this chain right on top of here and that'll allow you to display him. He can be displayed pretty much easily with, you know, with the chain. But again, if it's distracting, you can remove it or you can use it as a keychain. No, you can do that too and again he is pretty heavy he's a pretty heavy figure and last we have kong who uh speculation i have is that i feel by the end of this movie he will be known as king kong so that's his little uh speculation here again he looks like his articulation because but it's just the the ceiling of how the figure was put together the head sculpt he doesn't really look that much like kong if i if i had to be completely honest with you he does not look like kong whatsoever the head and it could just be the expression with the mouth open which is actually very good good i actually do like the detail on the teeth it's very cool and but he just he's just and he's again he's really heavy because they are made out of die casts this one is a little bit more sturdy i don't feel like these hands are gonna snap off like don't make con bring these hands in i am a little sad that they didn't paint right here the new gauntlet or like i don't know what it is like people have been joking it's an finley gauntlet or it's you know something like a transformer arm that he's had going on like if it's an injury or if it's just an upgrade that they won't even explain in the movie which will be explained in the tv show that they did spoiler alert, they didn't explain that either because it takes place before all this is going to happen so same thing you can remove the keychain if you want to display him without being a keychain that is definitely your choice you can do that there you guys have it metal figures godzilla x kong the new empire these figures are a must-have if you are a godzilla fan even if you're not like a fan of the new american films that have been coming out since 2016 these figures look amazing they're only about five dollars at walmart and i believe you can also get them at target there's only four to collect so it's not like you're gonna break the bank basically 20 22 dollars for a set of four isn't a bad price considering today's overinflation in the market when it comes to collectible figures. But anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you enjoyed watching today's video, check out this video right here. And as always, guys, until next time.